Alright, story time. I waited about a year for this set to come in. Because, you know, I like different things on ARs, different design, all of that. <clears throat> Lantac Onyx set. I ordered the sets, ordered two of them back in November last year. <clears throat> After I got COVID, I said, fuck that. I'm going to just go ahead and go for it. What the fuck uh, I'd like and see. It's a badass set. You know what I mean? It, I like the, the lines in it. It's just different. I used to have that, uh, this handle that, that that's on the box. I used to have that. But um, I went ahead and built it up to this. I'm not done with it yet. I gotta go ahead and get a uh, device. It'll probably be a VG6 most likely. It was real hard to build. I went ahead and did a, a Lantac trigger in it. It's the ECT1, I think. Yeah, ECT1 curve trigger. <sighs> Excuse me. Uh, I went with the grid locked. Um, that's what might be throwing me off. I went with the Gridlock 416 handguard, and it's a, uh, what is that, 10 inch, I think. The barrel's a Daniel Defense, uh, 12 inch barrel. That's why we went ahead and did the pistol. But um, this is a Strike Industries as well. Um, I think it's their Cobra. But I went ahead and got some old school in this motherfucker. One of the ones I, I loved, WMD Bow Carrier Group. I love that. I did the ambidextrous strike industry selector. I like how that feels. My other ones. I'm gonna do the uh, vortex, of course. The AMG Gen 2. I gotta have a vortex. I love that shit. But this build, because I waited like a year for this this set, this build set. I don't know if it was a coating or what, but if you look right in here this pin as soon as you start going in all the way the the fucking um forward assist won't work i took it out a little bit it started to work fine um even putting them together real tight where, where the bolt comes in for the handle was offset a little bit if you see the line i don't like that line right there my shit's just got to be tight tight um yeah i'm gonna see what's up with it but it was tight when i first put the mag in there the mag wouldn't go in all of that shit it just like loosened up i'm not really used to this i mean i like strike industry stuff but um you know i like mine to be just flush flush so this right here kind of throws me a little bit and then it goes skinny right here i like my shit fat all the way through but yeah um that's the uh onyx I got another set, so um see what I do with the motherfucker. But a year, a whole year of waiting for that, and it came out like that. I'm gonna put some more sweeteners, like I said, put a, a muzzle device on there, a compensator, and go from there. But if anyone knows anybody from Landtac, let them know that coding it makes it diff difficult to, to build. It's hard as shit. But overall, the look of it. I love the look. The color was different. I didn't expect it to come in gray, but fuck it. It is what it is. I make do what I do, but I want a black set. So if anybody knows anybody from Landtac, let them know that right on.